In this video, I'm going to show you how I got an Arduino and 3D Studio Max to talk to each other. I have an Arduino hooked up to a USB port on the computer, and I have a potentiometer hooked up to one of the input pins. So when I adjust the potentiometer, I'm going to be changing the voltage going to the input pin. And I also have a 3D Studio Max scene with a box in it here. I'll be coming back to that, back to that later. Uh, but first, I need to program the Arduino. So, in the example sketches that come with the IDE, there's one in communication called Serial Call Response. And it deals with serial communication, which is what I'm going to be doing here. It doesn't really deal specifically with 3D Studio Max, but it's very well commented and explains pretty much what you need to do. So, I wrote a simplified version here and when it first runs um, as long as there's no data available on the port it's going to send a capital A every 300 milliseconds and if something sends that back it's going to go into a loop where it reads the voltage on the input pin uh, converts it to a value between 0 and 255 and then sends that to the computer and then it's going to wait for another signal at the port and do it all over again so I'm going to um, I'll compile and upload the sketch to the Arduino. So, okay, so if we take a look at it, you can see that the transmit LED is flashing. And the receive LED is right next to it, but it's not flashing right now because there isn't anything answering it. So, and uh, in fact, we can take a look in the serial monitor and look at the signal. And, and you can see that capital A, and that's what the board is sending to the computer right now. So, so far, so good. So now we move over to the 3D Studio Max side, and over here, um, I wrote a Max script to talk to the Arduino. Now it turns out that communicating on a port is really easy with Max script. All you have to do is use a .NET serial port object. You can see that here on this slide. You give it a string with the name of the port that the Arduino is on. In this case, it's COM3. And set the baud rate, which is set to 9600. Now, what this script will do is it will open that port, and it will listen for that capital A. And when it receives it, it will send it back, which kicks off the communication with the Arduino and tells the Arduino to send a value from the input pin. Then the script will take that value and apply it to the rotation of the box, and then send another signal to the Arduino, which sends another value, and so forth and so on. So I'll go ahead and start the script. And it says it's connected. So if we look at the Arduino, you can see that now both the transmit and receive LEDs are on. So now the Arduino and the 3D Studio are talking to each other. And if I adjust the voltage, the box in the scene rotates in response. So I'm going to turn that off now. And now if you look at the Arduino, you can see that it's not doing anything. That's because it's waiting for a signal to send another byte. And so similarly, if I turn the Max Script tool back on, it's not going to do anything either because it's waiting for a signal from the Arduino. So I broke the cycle when I turned it off. So they're both stuck. So to get out of this situation, I can push the reset button on the Arduino. And that'll kick everything. It'll kick off the sketch again. And so you can see everything is working. Everyone's communicating nicely again. And I can rotate the box. So that's an example of serial communication between an Arduino and 3D Studio Max. Thanks for watching.